we demonstrate a safe and robust side-to-side -side quadrocopter maneuver. The quadrocopter must move to between the pylons on the right side, to between the pylons on the left side, and back and forth repeatedly in this precise sequence while not exceeding the outer pylons. This is easily achieved using a standard tracking approach by providing a sinusoidal reference signal for the right to left motion while stabilizing the altitude, roll, and yaw. What happens under unmodeled disturbances? Can the sequence of alternatingly reaching the right and left sides be maintained? During the disturbance hold, the reference continues to pass and letting go now results in failing the desired sequence. Disturbances also yield unpredictable and unsafe behavior. As a result of the push, the quadrocopter achieves a maximum speed of 2.4 meters per second, much higher than the nominal maximum speed of 1.5 meters per second. Now we show our new method, which uses the reach control approach to handle the right to left motion and does not require a predefined signal to track. Instead, we employ a hybrid control design on the position velocity state space. For the side-to-side -side motion, the state must evolve within the shaded blue region shown in the plot, where we have defined separate affine feedback controllers for each triangle. Let's see if this method can avoid the issues with the tracking approach. And the desired sequence is successfully maintained. And, unlike the tracking approach, the quadrocopter's maximum speed is relatively unaffected due to push disturbances.